Okay, we have the, the second car. We're going to speak to the owner here. It, it is a Lancia, and we have Jason Wright. Hi, Jason. Excuse me. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Nice to be at Brooklands. It is a good location for a start to the rally. Yes, I'm disappointed that there are not more Brits here. I thought there'd be a lot of, a lot of uh, participants for the rally, but for some reason they're not. No, we, we were saying the same thing. We have only five entries in this rally this year. Um, I don't know if it's because they've, they've dropped a class. Uh, no, I don't think so. I think that there's just... It's an just they're not entering. Yeah. expensive proposition. Yeah, it's one more day in the rally, uh, and it's the more more mileage. You yeah, know? yeah. But uh, for me, it's wonderful to be starting from here. All my life, I've read about Brooklyn's and Prince Beera's exploits here, and John Cobb, and so I'm a real motoring enthusiast so this is very much a, a an excellent cool. place to start it's your first visit here by the sound of it no i've been here before oh, you have been before yeah. yeah i i was here as i was telling you i was excited to see prince Beera's uh glider in the museum as i said i knew princess Birabongs, who lived near me in lake arda and uh <laughs> excuse me uh, Bira was very much a lover of Lake Garda also, so a little bit of a connection. And then of course all the other things, the Napier, Napier Railton, and uh, I'm a fan of Alfa Romeo, and I had an Alfa that was sold by Thompson and Taylor, who were based here at Absolutely. Brooklyn's. Yeah. So yeah. there's there's quite a lot so of a lot of nice collections for, for you yeah. as well, isn't there? So you bought today the Lancia. Yeah. yeah. Tell us a little bit about this car. Well, it's a car that was specifically made for rallying, and if you look at the car, you'll see that the windshield it gives uh, the driver 100 total visibility. When you're sitting in the car. It's almost as though you don't see the car, you just yeah. see the road. It has a Ferrari engine with a lot of horsepower. And it's the first car that was really built specifically as a rally car. They had to make 500 of them to, to, to suit the regulations, but they really weren't trying to make road cars. They were making a proper rally car. No, you often see these in films, don't you, of the of rallying. Yeah, well, they, the, they dominated. Putting some rallying. welly in. Yeah, yeah, they dominated rallying, yeah. and it's a wonderful thing to drive, mm. and I'm very lucky to have it. So have you owned this car long, or is it just recent? Uh, no, no, I've had a long time. Not like yeah. the chap over there, he's only had his nine months. Yeah, well, he's, that chap, which one? The, the, the A40. Uh, the A40. Uh, only nine months. <laughs> No, I, this is my seventh Monte Carlo with this car. All oh, right, okay. And my fifteenth Monte Carlo. Mm -hmm. So I'm a bit of an addict. Yeah, it uh, does sound that way, doesn't it? Uh, You're pretty experienced at this one. Well, yeah, we've done it a lot. It's not really my thing, rallying. I have mm -hmm. to say, I just like the car and I like the event, but I prefer circuit racing. Right. It's got a certain prestige to it, hasn't it? The Monte Carlo Rally. It's got a nice. It does. Yeah. To well, it. it's a World Championship yeah, Rally that exactly. still exists today. Mm. And uh, my 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 navigator and I do these. Uh, I've been doing these things together for 20 years. Right. And he's the chief of police in my town, so. Oh. <laughs> So you should know what he's doing. He's pretty yeah. good at navigating as well. Yeah, and um, uh, yeah, we we um, are trying to do all the different starting points. You know, Monte Carlo Rally always started from different uh, cities yeah. around the world, and or not around the world, but around most of Northern Europe. So we've done Stockholm, Warsaw. Uh, Barcelona, Milano, Torino, Reims, okay. etc., etc. And, right, and, and now, this is the first time from London since we've been London. doing it. <laughs> yeah, well, that, it's got Londra written on the car. It is. Well, it is. We're right on the outskirts here, but yeah. we could count. We're, yeah. in, we're inside the M25, so that would count. Yeah, well, that's <laughs> a trouble too, isn't it? I, uh, 
that's that, that's the big challenge for today is the M25. Yeah, well, the M25, that's the way you're going down to Dover, is it, around that I way? I think so, You know, yeah. you're not staying off the motorway at all. Yeah. Uh, okay. So that should be fun. So it's Dover, cross on the ferry to Calais uh, and, and, then and stop then, over then. Yeah, we, it's a bit boring, actually, the yeah. first bit. And we head down to, to Langres in France. Right. And, and we have a time control there tomorrow night at at midnight okay and th- and that's when things start, start to get, to get exciting. a bit more interesting yeah then. yeah, yeah so we go well we don't have special stages first night but uh it's or the second night either, either. Right. but it's all night long so yeah. that's a challenge and it's in itself be a challenge staying awake the next day <laughs> uh, it's, it's it's tough yeah <laughs> okay well good luck I'm sure you don't need it of being an experienced man yeah, like you. Yeah, well, you, you always need some luck. Yeah. You know, anything can go wrong. You That's have high problem. hopes for this one. Well, we we just want to have fun, have fun and and get there. You know, yeah. get to the end. We yeah. we we've had some reasonable results in the past, but we don't take it very seriously. We it's 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 it's, a, it's, a it's an amateur isn't it? thing. It's the fun doing and, it. Uh, there are a lot of people that go and practice for a month before yeah. and I'd rather jump off a bridge, you know. I'd, <laughs> I just, just don't get it, you know. No, this is no. a, for me, this is a, just a fun event, fun event for yeah, old guys so. with old cars. Mm. <laughs> and yeah. that's the way I approach it. Yeah. Well, hopefully it'll be a bit warmer in Monte Carlo when you get there. Well, I was in Sweden on Sunday and it was minus 20. Was so. it? Oh, this is warm then. <laughs> well, actually, it's Kind of it's unpleasant. damp, isn't it? It's yeah. damp. Yeah, that's the trouble with this. Anyway. But yeah, it's been very cold down there oh, in Monaco. It? Yeah. yeah. Right. It's been one degree, two oh, right. degrees. Okay. So it's cold so it's probably not much warmer there. No, I don't think yeah. so. <laughs> oh, well, good luck anyway. Thanks so Have much. Have fun. Thank you. Five, four, three, two, one, go! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.